Uh, so this has been a great hymns uh, for us. Uh, we launched our integrated innovation framework and uh, the ability to be able to put together a unique combination of platform practices, services uh, wrapped in our uh, healthcare domain expertise uh, has been received very well by a lot of our clients and prospective clients. I look forward to uh, working with uh, uh, many of them in the coming year. It's really uh, wonderful to be out here at Tim's. Uh, it's tremendous to see the entire uh, vibrancy uh, in the entire uh, healthcare IT ecosystem. The contribution that Cities Tech is making to the entire uh, healthcare IT landscape, I think that is also uh, you know, really amazing. The clinical quality things for providers, for payers in years past, was just about people in a back room building those measures, submitting those measures. As those contracts become more prevalent, people are trying to operationalize those into their organization to execute on them. In order to operationalize those, you have to pull in more data, you have to pull in more processes, execution, workflows. That requires uh, the technology to support that. So the real-time workflows, the data is from a multitude of sources, and that requires a whole new technology stack that can accommodate to that. And so with that trend, you'll see more and more data get involved and the bigger systems uh, become required. It's been great to see the advancements that many EHR companies have made within interoperability. So if you look back at HIMSS last year, uh, a lot of the initial engagement has been very early on and uh, a very small sample size of large EHR providers integrating with other providers specifically to put differential content within their EHR. The other uh, trend that I, I put more as a personal interest, it's been interesting to see how technology that's currently being marketed from B2B uh, have a life uh, for a, a B2C type arrangement in the future.